everyone, welcome back to another episode of Siege Explores. This time we're staying in the W Hotel, having a little staycation in Brisbane City, thanks to bookingcredits.com. This hotel is really cool, it's really funky colours and as you can see just from the elevator it's got like these neon lights, a lot of bright pinks, but we need to go somewhere. Okay, Paul's a bit busy, we're going to come back tomorrow morning so instead we're going to go check out the gym. I brought my active wear. It's actually a really good gym. And you can watch YouTube. How's the bed? Uh, it's very comfy. I am already excited to put on my dressing gown and snookle up in bed. Okay, so for our stay here at the W Hotel, we have chosen the spectacular King Room. And this view right out onto the river has been epic. We've just watched the sun go down behind Mount Kutha behind us. Uh, and all the beautiful colours on South Bank and the Wheel of Brisbane and along the river, it's been so nice. But there's something else which is really cool about this place, and they have this cocktail bar. I believe it's in each of the rooms. Um, but inside here, this fridge, secret fridge, they've got some pre-made cocktails. This one interests me, Coffee House. Um, it is tequila, cold brew, coffee, orange bitters and filtered water um, and you have everything you need in here to mix up a beautiful cocktail by yourself during your stay. What's now? I am starving. It's nearly night time so that means dinner time. Today's video is brought to you by bookingcredits.com. They are an online platform where you can book your favorite hotels and accommodation and you have the right to earn 40% cash back. That cash back goes straight onto your card in dollars. It's not points, it's dollars or pounds or any other currency and it goes straight back onto your card that you made the booking with. So Corey, tell us what is bookingcredits.com and how does it differ from the normal booking reservation sites? So. Normal booking reservation sites will get the wholesale rate from the hotels and accommodations and then they take a big old slice as a commission and then they charge you that marked up price. Now bookingcredits.com is similar in the way they work but they do not take such a big slice and they pass that wholesale saving back to you in the form of cash back onto your card. Back to us, the customers. And we're going to show you now quickly how easy it is to book this is how we booked our hotel stay at W Hotel. So as you can see, there were different prices throughout the week that we wanted to book, but we wanted a weekend staycation, so we paid a little bit more. However, that does mean that we were getting more cash back on our card, and that will go straight back towards our next accommodation that we booked through bookingcredits.com. So if you're looking for a nice little staycation, or if you're lucky enough to travel further afield, then make sure you check out bookingcredits.com and earn yourself a nice little cash back to go towards your spending monies for your trip. We'll leave a link in the description and the comments below, so go and give it a click and start saving today. Woo!
And now, back to the vlog. Well, I am the old lady and I am going to bed, but look what this guy is doing. He has found the Jimba. Well, he found it as soon as we entered the room actually, and he brought his own gym from home because he knew this was here. Yes, I'm taking advantage of the beautiful glassware. We got some nice ice, and we have a fantastic view of South Bank and the lights. They look amazing out there. We've got up at the crack of dawn this morning and we're heading to the pool first thing. We're going to go and check it out. Hopefully there's no one around and we can take some photos. Alright, it looks like the clean up from yesterday but nobody else is here which is pretty nice so we're going to do a few laps because this is a nice heated pool. That is heated, so it's really warm in here. That might be because it's winter, maybe it changes in summer, but for now, I'm really enjoying it. You can do some laps? I'm gonna go do some laps because it's really nice and toasty warm. Right, so if you guys can see, we have the big pool area here, but right behind us is this bar here. It's called the Wet Deck. Um, and it turns into a bit of a vibe. We were here in the afternoon yesterday. It was a bit too rowdy for what we were doing. But yeah, it's a really cool vibe in there. Loads of music. Uh, there was a DJ, people just hanging out, having some drinks, having some snacks. Um, and you can come into the pool and vibe to the DJ because the music plays all through. So yeah, really cool place. We had our little swim, now we're gonna go head back up and get changed because we wanna go enjoy the breakfast in the cafe. But one cool thing we've noticed, every time we come in the elevator, depending on the time of the day, it changes on the bottom of the sign. So it says good morning. When we checked in, it was good afternoon and last night was good evening. I wondered why it was only our room that had a pink sign, but actually I realized it's because it changes color depending on the angle you're looking at it. So now it looks pink. But if I come this way, it's yellow! Hang on. That way? Yellow. Hotel, we're going to check out their breakfast menu. It is actually very nice. All my favourite things in there, so I expect it will be. Just needs a bit of chocolate. Okay, so I've gone with the mushroom tortilla and an oat mocha, and the mushroom tortilla looks so colourful. I'm going to taste it. Looks good. That's yummy. Oh, a bit spicy. We're just back in the room. We put our dressing gowns back on and now we're just chilling, watching the city cats and the kitty cats go past on the river below. And it's so nice to be up here. We can see the mountain ranges, the Great Dividing Range, Main Range National Park. We can see Cunningham's Gap, um, as well as Mount Cutha, and I think it's Springbrook and Tambourine further south. So it's a pretty epic view from up here. We're on the 20th floor and we have the river view. That whole area down there is South Bank and the Cultural Centre. You've got the famous Brisbane sign which is a really cool photo spot. You've got the Channel 7 wheel and then just a bit further up from that is the Botanic Gardens and the Man Made Lagoon. That place is absolutely full with backpackers and travellers and local families in the summer holidays because as you know Brisbane gets super hot so it's a great place to go. Loads of restaurants there. But but if you'd like to know more about South Bank, we did do a highlights vlog and we'll link it up there now. Checking out now, Bill? We are checking out now, sadly, but it's time to leave, so we better go. It'd be nice to stay in another W hotel somewhere else, eh? It would, they're very cool hotels and there's actually a lot around. I've had a look on their social media and there's some really cool ones in like Bangkok and elsewhere. So yeah, we'll definitely keep an eye out for W Hotel. And we're gonna book it. Bookingcredits.com. Okay guys, 
guys, so it's time for us to check out. Pretty sad because we've had an awesome stay here in W Hotel. And thanks again to bookingcredits.com. We will see you guys in the next vlog. Next week is our last week in Brisbane and we are packing up and going full time on the road. So join us, hit subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Bye.